folks. Thanks for tuning in to 2K Sports for our latest presentation of NBA basketball. With Hall of Famer Grant Hill and Brent Berry, this is Brian Anderson. We'll be hearing from Allie LaForce from the sideline. Hey, Allie. The Bucks' Chris Middleton has a fan and head coach, Mike Budenholzer. Bud said, quote, he's the ultimate professional, so consistent, and he doesn't... Well, he's a key player for them, Allie. Here we go. And so off the tip, it is New York. Now let's take a look at the Bucks' opening lineup. At forward, it's the talented Giannis and Middleton. Holiday and Allen are at guard form, and it's Lopez in at the five down low. I give a ton of credit to the Bucks front office beyond trading for Holiday and of course re-signing Giannis. You love how they filled in with those guys around that star power. Now here's Ana de Kumpo. It's hauled in by Robinson. Here's Randall. The 15-footer is good. Fleshing out his offensive attack here. Randall comfortable from that range to knock one down. Well, Brent, seems like every year the Bucks have to replace a key rotation player. Yeah, and tricky because they don't have the financial wherewithal to spend a ton of money with the contracts that have been given out. So it's about the right fit, the right personnel, and I think front office and coaching staff do a great job of identifying who those players are. Think back in that 21 season finally the Knicks breaking back into the playoffs you know it's been seven years since they got there and coach Thibodeau receiving the coach of the year honor well deserved and he drops a first it was such an impressive season, and yet New York couldn't quite replicate their success the following year, Brent. Yeah, B.A., they made some moves, and they were hoping to bolster the roster in some ways, but it just didn't go as expected, and now they're retooling again. And Lopez drops them both. Well, a big fellow with the ability and confidence at the free throw line is something that every team wants. You don't have to make those late substitutions. Keep your big guys on the floor. Now here's Barrett. Rose outside. Knocks it down from distance. And at the arc, Rose definitely picks his battles. But when he sees his chance, he knocks it down. Out of the Kumpo, pass to Lopez. Outside Holiday. Pass to Ana de Kumpo. Sinks that one after missing his first two attempts. Now one for three. And you love it when your star player gets down there and gets dirty, and that time a Tete Kumpo in there. Here in the first quarter, with about two minutes gone by. Randall, a screen on Anadokounmpo. Robinson. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That's on Brooke Lopez. And some surprise teams that started out hot have not cooled down. Their fans are wondering if this is the new normal. Well, B.A., it's easy for fans to jump to that conclusion. Take but look, the bottom line is you can't look too far ahead. You've got to stay in the moment and enjoy the ride. I wish I had done more of that when I was playing. Free throw good, Robinson. Well, Brent, for this Milwaukee organization, how big was keeping Giannis? Well, B.A., could you just give me another synonym for massive? I'll take all of them because, obviously, it is all about Giannis. And the title in 2021 helped big time to keep him in Milwaukee. But imagine if they lost him and went back to square one. You just don't replace guys who are this special. Or when he gets into a groove at the free throw line, it doesn't just last for tonight. This might be two weeks, two months, something like that. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. They'll pin that one on Julius Randle. And last season, Giannis passing Kareem Abdul-Jabbar as the Bucks' all-time leading scorer. He wants to finish his career in Milwaukee, so that total bound to grow.
And that one falls for Ana de Kumpo. And Grant, both Giannis and Kareem dominated the paint. But they get it done differently. Yeah, that they do. Kareem, possibly the best ever in the post. Whereas Giannis might be the most dominant slasher and driver in league history. So Honor to Kumpo nails both of them. And already Giannis has a regular season MVP, a finals MVP, plus a defensive player of the year award, winning all three trophies by the age of 26. Excellent. Now here's Robinson. Last game he had 34 points. Pocket six. Randall against Honor to Kumpo. New York no good that time either. For Ana de Kumpo, you can also throw in an all-star MVP. Brent, that puts him in elite company. Well, thanks, B.A. I did forget that one, and that's a major one, too. But the Greek Freak, just the second player ever to win those four awards. The first, of course, MJ. It just tells you Giannis is already an all-time great. Now here's Allen, continuing to put up the points, averaging 14 per game. And here is Barrett. Rose outside. Shoots over Lopez. Here's Robinson. Uses the glass on the layup. You don't want to ever give up points on the boards. That's the lesson for the team there. That's a hustle play to save points. Here's Holiday. The Knicks with the rebound. And so far, the team just one of five in that rim shrinking. He's going for the oop here. Another assist in the career of D. Rose. Here's Middleton. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. The three-pointer off the mark. And he's not the guy that you want to give a wide-open look from three-point range. They're lucky that that one doesn't cost them. Rose, the pass to Robinson, shoots over Allen. Robinson can't hit. The Bucks trail. Here's Ana Kumpo. Consistent production from him, averaging around 27 and a half points a game. To the inside. Oh, what a nice defensive play to disrupt the lob. Barrett with it, Middleton covering, and it's Randall with the jam. Now this kind of balance is going to make a huge difference in R.J. Barrett's improvement in the league. When to score and when to be the assist maker. Timeout called, Milwaukee. teams who excelled at rebounding over the last month. Number one, the Knicks. The fourth spot held by Milwaukee. And both of these teams have been great at rebounding the ball over the last month, making sure they're doing whatever they can to get the boards off the miss. Here's Middleton. And again, it's the Bucks missing. And nobody getting a hand in his face in that painted area. That's a miss he's going to be disappointed with. Pass to Robinson. Let's go with a three. Gets the three ball to go. Robinson's got his third basket of the night. Building a big advantage early with a terrific all-around performance. Well, if I was baking up a lead, I'd add two ingredients. One would be playing smart. The other one playing selfless. They've done that tonight. Serve it up. Now here's Peyton. How quiet so far offensively. Searching for his first points of the game. Boy, I like their energy coming in. <laughs> Terrific execution so far. Well, if there were four or five boxes to check in terms of the game plan tonight, they might have checked six. I mean, they're doing everything out there. Uh, for him, it's harder to miss that shot than it is to make that shot. I think he was anticipating a bit of a bump there. Randall, a screen on Middleton. His first shot coming late. Rejected by Anadokounmpo. And they'll get another chance. 
And a big finish by Robinson. Uh, the man was wide open there, and Julius Randle understood the timing to get him the ball to get that score. Timeout called. Milwaukee. Freedom. He's checked in for Lopez. Milwaukee has gone 0 for 3 from downtown. Middleton from the outside, and it's good. First made shot in four attempts. And that kind of consistency from Middleton from three, that's huge. Now here's Rose. In his last outing with 12 points. Knocks down the triple. Robinson's got 14. He doesn't look satisfied with the lead right now. He wants more, and he looks like he's going to get it. And he got the whistle on the way up, so he'll be headed to the line for a pair. This might make you feel old, but Derrick Rose won his MVP over a decade ago, the 2011 season. Whew, that was something special. D. Rose in 2011, MVP for his hometown team, the Chicago Bulls. And what a year. Top 10 in scoring and assists. He just won that vote in a landslide. That Bulls team winning 62 games. And it beat up on a loaded Eastern Conference. That was LeBron's first Miami season. And Boston still had the big three. Derrick Rose was getting it done. Robinson, he's checked in for Julius Randle. Richardson's checked in for Milwaukee. Misses, so he splits the free throws. Since hiring Tom Thibodeau, every year the Knicks have been at the bottom of the league in pace. Well, Thibs rhymes with grind, doesn't it, B.A.? I mean, it doesn't really, but it should. Peyton's shot is good. This defense is getting spaced out. Three of the last five buckets have come from way beyond the arc. Robinson against Hanna Kumpo. Such good instincts from Robinson there to throw that one away. The way they've gotten after rebounds has been impressive. Just a perfect pass and some pretty slick body control on the finish, too. Man, that's butter. Robinson against Hanna de Kumpo. Good work defensively by Robinson. Hate to say it, but if they're still trailing at the final buzzer, a lot of this is going to be felt by him. His shooting tonight has just been atrocious. Now here's Rose. He's averaging just around eight and a half points a game to the paint. Oh, and he blocks it off the glass. Wow. Great defense by Giannis using his length that time, and that shot had no chance. Again, Anadokounmpo missing. He's not very hard to defend right now. This is when the defense might step back and let him try to find his range. Rose finds Robinson. Rose against Holiday. Kicks it out to Barrett. Let's the three fly. That one falls. Nice feed that time from Rose. And the Knicks lead by 21. The assist numbers certainly stand out. They've really emphasized ball movement here today. And the jam by Anadokounmpo. Oh, I would love to see Giannis in the dunk contest. Wouldn't that be sweet? Just an awesome display of athleticism on our AT&T 5G Slam Cam. Robinson, a screen on freedom. From outside, off the mark. Milwaukee has gone one of four from deep. Anadokounmpo, the pass to Holiday. to Tecumpo with the stuff. Well, an outstanding floor general right there. Holiday has switched between point guard and off guard and a great feel for when guys are open. 
Rose can't connect. Milwaukee shooting has not been great early. Just 27%. Here's on it a Kumpo. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. You know, for this Bucks team, they seem to play together as well as any team we've seen recently. Yeah, this team has a bunch of players who complement each other very well. And they've got so many different ways that they can play on the floor. That's what makes them so successful. Well, that <laughs> and Giannis. And that one falls for Anadokounmpo. Of course, one of the league's best scorers. Giannis poised to be one of the game's all-time best. So for the Knicks, Ibaka, he's checked in for Barrett. Burks comes in for Payton. And it's Bradley in for Rose. Favors checked in for the Bucks. Watanabe comes in for Middleton. And so Anadokounmpo nails both of them. Robinson with it. 16 points for him. And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Opportunity for a three-point play here. And he was dominant in their last outing. And the same thing here tonight. He is in a terrific group right now. Seems to be nobody standing in his way. No roadblocks for him to get to his spot, capitalize, and continue to be aggressive. And the Bucks making a change here. Nora's checked in. Free throw good, Robinson. Here's Richardson. Boy, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Outside Holiday. Here's Watanabe. Off target from three-point range. Now the Knicks with it. It's an 18-point game. They put up a nice win against Toronto last time out. And guys, those road games are never easy. But they had a solid strategy going in and stuck to what they do best. Yeah, watching that game quarter to quarter, they sped up, they slowed down, but they executed in every facet. That was execution to perfection. Textbook transition offense. Yeah, once you burst through a seam like that, you got to look right towards the rim. Sweet play. One-handed tomahawk. That's a guaranteed highlight, B.A. <laughs> Check out the bench. They flew out of their seats after that. Now here's Holiday. 11 points for him last game against Brooklyn. Yeah, but all around offensively, the performance was great. He knew when he had it going, but he also knew he could get other guys going. So his passing right up there on the level with his scoring in that one. Ibaka, the pass to Robinson. 127 left to play in the first quarter. That's good from Robinson. On the assist from Robinson. Robinson's got 24. An excellent perimeter offense so far. Their shooters are clearly in a great rhythm. Left side, Holiday. Outside, Richardson. Six to shoot. 4-3. It's hauled in by Robinson. Burks against Richardson. On the wing, Burks. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Pass to Ibaka. Outside Robinson. Robinson finds some space. And good. Got the friendly bounce off the right side of the rim. And the Knicks lead by 21. Burks against Richardson. Down low. Here's Favors. Perfect pass to set up the lay-in. Nice use by Richardson on the pick and roll. Whether he's passing or shooting, his decision making in this one has been superb. Burks finds Ibaka. There's 14 seconds left in the first quarter here. Now Burks. Looking at the numbers, he's putting up seven points a game. Over Richardson. Misses off the right iron. And so it's the New York Knicks out in front by 19 going into the break. It hasn't taken them too many shots to get their points. They're winning with efficiency. We'll be right back. It's been a lopsided game. We'll see if that changes here in the second. All right, guys.
Guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Knicks? Well, hey guys, I mean, can we talk about how unselfish they've been? Just racking up the assist numbers, moving it around with great precision. Well, I like that they've also emphasized the three-point line. They've drained a good number from beyond the arc this year. On the court for Milwaukee here in the second. Josh Richardson out there with Grayson Allen. Then it's Yuta Watanabe. Then it's Ennis Freedom. And it's Nuora in at the four. Now here's Richardson. Freedom, a screen on Payton. And it's Gary Payton, the second with a foul. That's his first foul. First personal foul. First team foul. Freedom, a screen on Payton. Richardson, the pass to Freedom. The Knicks pull it in. And you have to think that they're leading this game because of how they've controlled the boards tonight. And here is Burks. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. And it's Freedom with a rebound. Here's Allen. Richardson, the pass to Freedom. Here's Nora. On the wing, Richardson. Inside. Here's Freedom. Ooh, great D that time from Ibaka. New York has gone six of nine from three-point range. Well, Brent Canada is well represented in the NBA these days. R.J. Barrett may be leading the charge. Man, if you put together a team of nothing but Canadian players, you'd have a pretty strong five out there. And Barrett's a guy who might be the leader of that squad. Any hope of coming back to win this game looks near impossible. I know. The way things have gone so far, hard to imagine. For three, Allen. Offensive board. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. He just missed it. Burks with it. Picked up by Allen. And the whistle on the shot. Got some contact there. Misses the shot, but he'll shoot two. Hey, we see plenty of three-point shots every game, Brent. Would you say it's still a shooter's league? Yeah, I would say it's still a scorer's league, B.A., rather than a shooter, because, look, a lot of people can take shots. Uh, there aren't too many that make them efficiently. So uh, that part is, is going nowhere. I think it's about creating points and trying to get it to the, the most opportunistic way you can score. That's what the offense's job is to do. And the first one at the line is good. The Bucks making a switch here. Middleton's checked in. He does not get the second one. Well, Middleton, a guy who's just so effective out there. He puts up points. He scores with great efficiency. And we've just seen him in so many clutch moments just come through for this team. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Knicks. And as teams are grinding through their schedules, let's see how it's going out east. You take a look at the Knicks. They've been outstanding halfway through this season, looking cohesive and playing for one another. And, of course, Milwaukee, only two spots back. Well, right now, for New York, you have to really give it to them. I mean, they are backing up all the preseason hype. They've been outstanding early. And don't count on that coming to an end anytime soon. The talent level of this squad is off the charts. And with the momentum they're gathering here early in the year, they could steamroll through the season. Now here's Richardson. They look to him to score consistently, averaging around 13 and a half a game. Pass to Freedom. Here's Nora, down to five on the shot clock. The rebound by Burks. And Middleton also capable of preventing points at the other end, Brent. And I think this progression of Middleton having that length and switchability along with experience is helping him build that defensive resume. He'll hit the defensive glass. Just a terrific all-around player. And let's swing it over to the sideline and hear from Alley. Thanks a lot. Well, Giannis Antetokounmpo has won MVPs. Defensive Player of the Year and a championship. But he says, quote, I am not satisfied. As the leader of this team, that's the tone I set. I don't care about trophies. I care about getting better. And that's what I've done my entire career. Brian, he stays focused. Nose to the grindstone, Alan. Thanks for that. Now here's Peyton. Back to Burks. Randall, a screen on Allen. 
Burks passes to Randall. Cam is Randall with the jam. Offense has been hard to come by so far. A much needed bucket right there. Yeah, the buckets have been few and far between, and neither team able to get into any sort of offensive rhythm. Here's Freedom. He had a 12 point outing in their last game against Brooklyn. Middleton passes to Freedom. And they force the shot clock violation. Great D. Well, a chance to check out the stats for him. And the month he's been having has been phenomenal. Upping his game and putting up a good number of points, he really looks energized and engaged on offense. Rose has checked in for Burks. Lopez, he's checked in for Milwaukee. Giannis Antetokounmpo comes in for Nora. New York has gone 0 for 2 from outside in the second quarter. Rose, the pass to Barrett. Richardson against Rose. Randall on the screen. The three, Barrett. Rebound, Milwaukee. Middleton's got a rebound number five here tonight. Pass to Anadokounmpo. Now here's Allen to stop the drought. Good. And Anadokounmpo gets the assist. Allen's gotten himself on the board with a three there. The Knicks have gone one for six in the second quarter. Not great. Rose, the pass to Barrett. And it's blocked right out of the air and controls it. Anadokounmpo against Barrett. Lopez, the screen on Barrett. Anadokounmpo, the pass to Allen. Now here's Lopez. Looking at his numbers, putting up eight points a game. Richardson against Randall. Rose outside. Back to Randall on the wing, Peyton puts up a three. Rebound, Milwaukee. Honor Kupo's got six rebounds now in the game. Unloads from 13. That one falls. Honor Kupo has got 13 now. Sometimes Giannis waits to take over a game. Not tonight. This is epic. Rose against Richardson. Shoots off the step back. The rebound by Allen. Milwaukee has gone one of four from three-point land here in the second. Oh, there's the alley. Peyton against Allen. Now here's Peyton. Tight defense on him. Rose with it. Randall, a screen on Richardson. Rose finds Ibaka. Another miss. Boy, they're in a funk right now. Yeah, ever since the Nets relocated to Brooklyn in 2012, the rivalry between the Nets and Knicks has intensified. Now, both teams trying to prove that New York belongs to them. Now, here's Ana Kumpo. Can't cash in the 10-footer. Rose outside. Three-pointer. New York no good that time either. Well, Milwaukee's shooting only 31% in the game. It'll be hard for the Nets to take New York City away from the Knicks. They've been there so long. That's <laughs> so true, B.A. But the Nets have attracted more star players lately. Top free agents choosing to go to the Nets instead of the Knicks. We'll see if this trend continues moving on. Now here's Randall. He had a 12-point outing in their last game against Toronto. Yeah, what about his work on the glass? I mean, he was an all-around contributor to a winning effort. And again, the Knicks missing. Lopez passes to Richardson. Lana de Kumpo outside. And there's the foul. It'll go on Derek Rose. That's his first foul. Milwaukee calls the timeout. They come into this one following a loss to Brooklyn. Just a tough road loss. You're going against players who are comfortable shooting in their own building. You have to find a way to disrupt their focus. Yeah, they couldn't do it in that one. Always a step slow. 
and closing out the shooters and maybe even recognition of who was on the floor. Just not enough energy, and that's a tough way to win on the road. Here's Holiday. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. Shot clock at six. Watanabe on the wing. Kumpo outside. Shoots over Robinson. It's hauled in by Robinson. Robinson's got his seventh rebound here tonight. And it's amazing. Their slim advantage on the board seems a lot larger than it is. Robinson on the wing. That one falls. Nice feed that time from Rose. Robinson's got 28. And passes like this demonstrate Rose's unselfish attitude, which is why his teammates enjoy playing with him. Back to Anadokounmpo. Shoots over Robinson. And it's Anadokounmpo with the miss. And he's got so many ways to score in the post. Just nifty, uses fakes. You have to have a body on him every time he's down there. Now here's Rose. Robinson, a screen on favors. The three, Barrett, gets it to go. Makes him two for five. RJ right there, moving without the basketball, and that helps him to get to an open spot on the floor. That creates the rhythm. Anadokupo finds favors. Rose against Holiday. Pass to Anadokupo. He can't get that one to fall. Good work defensively by Robinson. Maybe there are ways to contribute that don't involve shooting the basketball. That's the best way that maybe he can help them out in trying to win this game. Now here's Rose. This one for three. The shot no good. Ah, uh, you love basketball. Couldn't miss in the first quarter. Now can't make it in the second quarter. Got to be eating at him just a bit. against Richardson. Offline with a three. The Knicks shooting at a 48% clip from the floor. Robinson passes to Rose. Back to Robinson. And count that. Two points and a chance for one more at the line. This looks like he's got more feel tonight. Like he's really got a good grip on that ball as he's letting it go. You know, and where the Bucks seem to dominate every year is on the glass, particularly at the defensive end. Number one in the league the last four seasons. Burks, he's checked in for New York. Mind the lane. Mind the lane. One shot. And Grant, I guess for the Bucks, hey, you can't teach size. And they're good fundamentally as well, B.A. I mean, they block out, they fight to maintain position. If you're going to beat them, it probably won't be with second chance points. Now here's Holiday. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. They really have a commanding lead, not just in points, but in rebounds as well. Pass to Bradley. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Two minutes. Here's Robinson, fires the three, gets the three to fall. Robinson's got eight points here in the quarter. Another triple for him. His fourth of the night after that monster first quarter where he hit three of them. Now Richardson. Kumpo, a screen on Robinson. And he lobs it up. Robinson with a steal. Rose against Holiday. A minute 20 left in the half. Robinson against Anadokounmpo. Robinson passes to Robinson. Drops in the three. Robinson's got 37. <laughs> I just love the ball. Pass to Watanabe. Here's Favors. Anadokounmpo, right side. Here's Watanabe. Good. 
And Arana Kumpo gets the assist. Watanabe's got five. Well, that Greek freak nickname is, is apropos. I mean, he can handle it, he can pass it. The combination of size and athleticism. What a talent. Now here's Burks. To the middle. Tipped. Robinson in the post. Arana Kumpo's there. Just one second separating the shot clock and the game clock. Pass to Watanabe. Now here's Ana de Kumpo. Oh, it's blocked. It deflects off the backboard. Rose outside. Over favors. No good on the buzzer beater. And so it's New York. Firmly in control with an impressive 28-point lead as the quarter ends. The hustle they've shown on defense has been tremendous. Well, now a minute to check in with Allie LaForce. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Coach, the offense is flowing. What will be your message to the team at halftime? 